Although it's hard, because sometimes you have good stuff in the past. Like, I liked, I like being a kid. I mean, technically, I guess I'm still a kid nowadays. I mean, it's not like, you know, I'm old, but college makes you feel old, because people do, like, you know, I don't want to say, like, grown-up shit, but <laughs> they're doing grown-up shit, man. Internships, jobs, shit like that, and here I am, on the fucking computer, uh, <laughs> just playing video games. Just don't get me wrong, I fucking love it, and it's really awesome. But sometimes, just like, what am I supposed to do? What is, what's society accepted, and what's normal? Is this normal? I don't know, this definitely is normal. This is this job wouldn't exist fucking five years ago. Um, so that's definitely, you know, that's definitely it. And how long is this going to last? That's what scares me. I don't know how long this is going to last. So do I want to focus all my efforts on here? Um, no, I can't. Obviously, I'm going to get my degree in school. I feel that's really important. That's just something to have. And if you don't get your degree in school, well, then you're going to limit yourself in the future. And you're, it's kind of a bad decision. Um, but after I get the degree... How much do I go for a job, and how much do I go for trying to make YouTube what I want to do? Because granted, no job's going to be as fun as this. That is for shit sure. Actually, you know what, maybe, because sometimes this job gets very lonely. <laughs> I need a hug sometimes. No, but I'm just saying that is because, oh uh, yeah, you, you, I have my social life outside of the internet. But sometimes I always wonder, like, what's a work relationship like? You know, there, there are no work relationships here. Our work relationships involve people, you know, over the internet. Which, I mean, granted, some people live in the same area, so you could always do that. But it's not like, oh, hey, after work, you want to go to the bar and just grab a beer and just, you know, hey, let's have the work football game or the the uh, this work softball team. That, that doesn't happen here. <laughs> you know, so it's 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 like I feel like am I missing out on a, a, a crucial part of life by doing this? I don't know. So these are the things I just think about because you obviously have to think about them. You can't just go, yeah, sometimes it's nice to be, like, willy-nilly in life. Like, la la la, life doesn't really matter because sometimes life is a big joke and you gotta treat it like a joke sometimes. Otherwise, you will literally lose all your hair, stress out, and die in early death. And, like I said, I've said numerous fucking times, I fully believe you have one life to live, so you have to make it good and do what you can do. But, what does that mean you have to do? Is that mixing work and play? Is that all play all the time? What does it involve? So, thanks, man. These are things you gotta think about. If you don't think about it, well, someone's got to think about it for you. And holy shit, this level's taking a long goddamn time. Fuck it, we'll jump for America! I can't believe some people actually get offended when I say jump for America. Or when I say for America, sometimes. Come on, what do you want me to say? For for Sweden? Alright, I guess I can, but I'm not Swedish. Hey, if you make a video, you could say for Sweden. Alright? <laughs> I'm saying for America. And sometimes, you know, I'll say for Italy. Because, I don't know, sometimes they need some love. To God fucking damn it. <laughs> Man, we got some deep shit going on in this game. I like it sometimes when the comments get deep, and I like it sometimes when the commentary itself gets deep. When it's more than just a normal commentary. This is good. This game's allowing me to find my commentary style and, and get back to it a little bit, because I feel like I was lacking a bit, and I apologize if you've noticed that in future video or past videos, where it's been more reactionary and not uh, proactive in terms of commentating. I've been more letting the scenes unfold, and normally that wasn't like me. Me, I'm more... I have shit to talk about, so we're gonna fucking talk about that. So I apologize if if the commentaries have been lacking. Let me know. You know, honestly, if something's not subpar, let me know. I can only go by the views. That's the only. That's my only indicator when people don't tell me. When, like, someone just stops watching a series or when series just start dying off, I can only assume the commentary's gone to shit. Um, which I hope it hasn't, because this is what I have to do. Um, but, you know, let me know. You know, let me... Honestly, don't, don't feel afraid... You know, as long as you're going to be legitimate about it, not like how you guys are, or some of you guys, it's not, not meant to be a blanket statement, but some of you guys on, like, Katawa Shoujo, for example, like, this game's perverted and bullshit and it sucks and I hope you die a horrible death. That does not do me anything, because I'm like, ah, chalk went up for troll. But if that one guy actually had a legitimate um, complaint, just saying, chill, you know, I'm not liking the way it's going, it's too slow, you're doing the same stuff over, well, then, you know what? Then, boom, I'm going to make it my prerogative to alert him when Act 2 starts, so we can get a different story involved, so we can be different. So if you want to be proactive in the comment section, go for it. You know, tell me what you want to see. That's what I'm here to, I'm here to entertain myself, and I'm here to entertain you. Uh, that, that is, that's my mission statement. Entertain myself and you with variety. Um, unfortunately, and that's how it's just going to have to be, because I don't do this full time, and because I don't do this as a, uh, as a legitimate job, yet, because, uh, because of school and other stuff and still being unsure if it's even possible, uh, because I don't have, I don't have the huge, I have a nice size fan base, I really do, and I love every single one of you guys, but I don't think I have the fan base that's capable of doing it yet, um, 
So, oh, fuck me. So then, for the most part, it's... I'm doing it for me. I mean, yeah, granted, it's, it's gotta entertain you guys, but when I pick the game selection, it's gotta be something that I have to enjoy doing, otherwise, then... What the hell am I doing? It can't be something that is, comes out forced. That's the last thing I want the commentaries to sound. I don't want them to sound forced at all. Um, commentaries have to sound natural. They have to flow. They have to be cool. They have to be rico suave. You know, that, that's, that's what a commentary should be, and that's what I try and make mine to be. So... I have to do, oh my god, if I fuck it up one more time, I'm just gonna start a shucking, fucking knocking. Yeah, oh, hey. Oh, there was another one over here. I didn't realize there was no more on this side. Oops. Yeah, I know, I got super jump, man. And I didn't beat the part time. Because I was sucking. Oh, I still did beat the part time. Around the world, in 80 days, Jackie Chan and Christian Faze. But yeah, I got I got this. Oh, okay. That's fucking cool. I guess we should call Christopher Columbus on the fucking line and tell him, "Hey, what happened to the earth being round?" It's got my ass stepped in. Whoa, it got all dark and all spherical. Oh. Uh oh, no, 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 no. oh fuck me, Charlie. Who's Charlie? Why is he fucking me? Is he Charlie Sheen? Charlie Sheen would be a goddamn animal. He wouldn't care. I'd be polite about my feelings. You'd be like, well, hold still. It's gonna fucking hurt. Oh no! Hey, it's the universe! And now I'm dead. You ever wonder what it'd be like just to explode? I mean, in the sincerest possible form ever. You know, obviously, I don't think you'd feel anything because your senses, your nerves would be vaporized before you could feel anything, but just to get ripped apart. I don't know, I've thought about it once or twice. I've come to the conclusion every time it'd be extremely shitty. And there is nothing good about it. But I've thought about it. Can't say I haven't. You know, just I guess after playing the darkness or something, or just in general. Yeah. Think about weird, morbid things sometimes. And it fucking makes me sick, man. It makes me sick to my goddamn stomach. Oh, sweet. Alright, skyscraper. I'll climb your tower. I'll climb your shaft with my balls. No, I can't do that. That's immature. And that's inappropriate. Seriously, though. I'll climb his tower with my balls. Wee! And upsy doozy. Where the hell are we going? Where? Oh shit, okay, that side. Boing, boing. The actual physics engine is actually pretty good for a arcade game. I wonder if that's the reason why they don't, they don't can't sell anymore. Maybe their licensing ran out? I should look into that. Um, and if you do have it downloaded, if you if you bought it in the past, uh, and like for example you switched hard drives or something, go to your download history. Uh, that's where you're gonna find it. Uh, it's the only place you're gonna find it for the time being. It's in your download history. You may have, honestly, I had to go through years of download history to find it. Because like I said, this was downloaded in 2006. Um, but it is in your download history. It's definitely there, and you can still download it from their servers. It's just you can't buy it anymore. You know how it is, man. Honestly, if I couldn't download this, I think I'd request a refund. Because, you know, even though I got my value from it already, I still, I want more value out of it. I didn't purchase a license, I bought the goddamn game. That'd be bullshit. They probably screw me over the terms of the agreement saying like, Oh, well, you know, any Xbox Live game you buy, if we take it off the marketplace, you're screwed. And there was another game. I, wait, maybe I'm completely wrong. Maybe it wasn't Marble Bless. It could have been. Um, maybe it wasn't. I, I'm, pretty sh I'm pretty sure it was Marble Bless. This entire time we've been saying that Marble Bless isn't on the marketplace anymore. I know for a fact Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles you can't buy anymore. Uh, but you can still download from your history. Maybe... Maybe it was Marble Bless as well. I don't know. I guess I'm going to have to check. What the hell am I going to do now? How the hell do I get over there? Okay, well I guess I'll do this. We really is a fucking tall skyscraper. I can't really fuck it up, otherwise then we're going to be in uh, up Shit's Creek a little bit. Dawson's Creek. Shit's Creek. It's the worst creek imaginable. Actually, you ever been up Shit's Creek without a paddle? Not even just- OH NO! NO! Oh, oh, come, oh, fuck me with a Dawson's paddle. Oh, I bounced. Now I'm fucked. Eh, fuck it. Explode. We're not restarting it. That's a long goddamn climb. Dawson's Creek. Without a paddle. Fuck, man. The time just looks weird. The sevens look weird in the time. I don't know why. They just do. Maybe it's just me imagining shit. Wait till it gets to a seven. The seven looks weird. No, okay, maybe not. I guess I'm imagining shit. It's fun to imagine shit too. 
It's actually fun just to pretend like you're just crazy sometimes. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Boom! Oh, shit! Okay, where's the finish? Where's the finish? Thank you, thank you. Gentle, gentle elevator. Please don't caress my balls too hard. Thank you. You're a hero. And your balls will be forever caressed by the Great Showcast.